such an easy game to play I need a place to hide away, away, away. Hello, um, okay, my name is Clara Pullman and I'm a freshman at Scott Catholic. <laughs> and this is Relent with lyrics taken from Jar of Hearts. Who do you think you are? The juice box and the milk carton eyed me like I was getting to choose between a kindergarten Red Bull and a five-year-old's nightmare. My sister's voice was in the back of my head, reminding me that it was not very ladylike to belch bubbles in front of boys. The first time I fathomed the way a boy would look at me with revulsion because I was being myself, and my fault was found in the result of another woman's opinion. But this girl who once confidently crawled into a dishwasher, believing it was a blast to the constellations, is now smothered by one million eyes that stare with utter encouraging disappointment. I learned to live half a life. The first time I saw that black tube filled with eye goo and a jar filled with nothing more than runny face paste to cover teenagers' acne was the day after you told me I wasn't that fat. Who knew muck on a stick could fill the inevitable wound of a sixth grader, seventh grader, eighth grader longing for an empty stomach with a side of thighs? Pathways of passing periods have evolved into a wicked world filled with horns attached to Barbie doll heads and lipstick enclosed onto a pucker where words will echo into eternity, gymnasiums, bathrooms, but weren't meant to be heard at all. Don't you know I'm not your ghost anymore? When you first introduced me to your confederate, she did a full body scan. As I reached out to shake her hand, she barely grasped it. And I couldn't tell if that was a metaphor for the way my stomach was wobbling or how I'm too easily controlled. Or maybe she felt my thoughts in my hand and maybe I just wished it would stop. You have become the center of my universe without my permission. My words are shaking the place I once felt safest. Now it makes me question how you began, cycled and ended the positivity I felt inside my skin. I never gave you permission. Every time I now walk by a sheet of glass and stare, I struggle with the word recover because I don't want the world to know that I might not have survived someone else's opinion. My middle school innocence blended with your taunting rhymes still circle throughout my mind, but I won't allow your words to have the privilege to mold my actions. I will not let you mold my actions. I will not settle for a face painted Juice box bubbleless world. All right, y'all, give it up one more time for Scott.